the governmental mm. uses of AI mm. and also the public sentiments towards that. There is always mm. uh, a certain degree of mistrust between governments uh, mm. and c- mm. citizens mm. and the use of their data. Yeah. Uh, how would you say governments should approach that issue in terms of the uses of AI for security and public sentiment towards AI? Mm. Yeah, my, I think I think that's a that's a big um, big question. Uh, uh, if we start just talking about the the sentiments, uh, I, I found actually I knew I knew you sent me the question before, so I actually uh, looked into it, and and there is w- in twenty twenty one there was a big sort of. Um, survey done, 17,000 respondents uh, spanning, I think it was 15 countries or something. And then they had a sort of, let's say, uh, open, uh, open-ended open responses. And they asked people, uh, these 17,000 people, uh, what do you think about AI? Wh- wh- well, what are your associations when you hear the word AI, artificial intelligence? And and they uh, ended up when with these open-ended sort of answers. They ended up in, in four types of uh, responses, or they could group the responses into four types, four types of sentiments. And the first one was uh, exciting. That is, uh, and it was related to words like good, hope, exciting, amazing, etc. The second one was also quite positive. Was useful. That is helpful, productivity, assistance, human tasks, benefits, etc. But then there were two that were a uh, little bit more negative, and the, the the first one was worrying. And there you ha- got concepts like concern, cautious, skeptical, creepy, danger, distrust, fear, bad, privacy, uh, tracking, AI replaces humans, etc., etc. So that was the third. <laughs> Sort of group of, of responses, and and the f- the the fourth one was futuristic, that is advanced automation, uh, world changing, uh, alien robots, etc. So sort of futuristic oriented, uh, and so I think they are both uh, positive, very positive, and uh, and very negative sort of sentiments here. And I think the, the, your question there about the sort of the negative sentiments, um, I think, well, that needs to be uh, sort of uh, understood and, and taken care of and understanding why and what is it that makes people uh, sort of talking about it in terms of worrying them. I mean, the third group there, what is it that makes people worried about it and why? Um, because um, uh, I think uh, there is also, I think this is not my research area, but there have been done sort of certain experiments with, with um, AI. Uh, and they've seen that sometimes uh, th- these, these demonstrate that humans often fail to trust an AI uh, when they actually should trust it. And the opposite, but also that humans follow an uh, AI maybe when they should not follow an AI. So that, that some kind of um, coming back to that, maybe we need to make AI more explainable, at least try to do it, and don't be more pedagogical and make it explainable. So explainability and transparency maybe are two sort of key words here. Yeah, I think... Especially you pointed out exactly the pedagogical aspect of it mm. when you were talking about uh, it in the medical uh, sciences, but uh, don't you believe that there needs to be a societal education about AI from mm. perhaps yeah. in a yeah. high school uh, yeah. type of mm. a situation yeah. because it's becoming something that is encompassing mm. everyone's life yeah. in different aspects? Yeah, right? exactly. I, I think so. And uh, I, maybe I think it, it comes also with this sort of fake news sort of uh, discussion. So, uh, w- I mean, AI is part of that. Uh, so I think, and, and we've seen that in schools, there is uh, much more attention to these uh, things in schools, learning pupils and students to understand how is the fake news created? What is, how is it that we can actually do it? So that maybe that's part of that discussion. So I think it's, um, yeah, I, I, I agree with you. I think it's, it's uh, um, um, but uh, maybe there's, there's more of the pedagogical challenge. How do we make it more pedagogical? 
So uh, we need sort of uh, more uh, more research on that, and maybe we need r research from very many different areas, uh, uh, psychology, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, to, to sort of uh, create this uh, explainability.